What's going on guys, welcome back to another Cedar Outdoors video and today we're going to be working on the mini, setting some scroll traps and going to look at some cars. <laughs> Alright boys, right now we're gonna go look at some cars, so we'll catch up you guys. Alright, well that was a botch. We just got kicked out by some old hags. But, so, we come here like all the time and look at cars and stuff, but we just got told that you are supposed to be over 21 or have to have an adult with you to look at some cars so I don't know what that's about but now we're gonna head up to Ace and get some parts for the Mini. Alright guys shout out to Ace for having what we needed we just got some fuel lines so we're gonna relocate the gas tank on the Mini so it's not in a super awkward annoying spot because that's pretty much what it is right now. Um, we're gonna probably like head over to advance and see if they have any sprockets or chain for the mini handbrake with the fiesta oh that was terrible ready we got this one right here try to get a better one i hope no car comes around the corner oh that's ripped oh oh <laughs> You're retarded. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Yo! 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 Yo, he's stuck. No, I'm oh, stuck. Oh, no. Alrighty, boys. Just got back from Ace. Got some fuel line. We're gonna um, set the squirrel trap, and then we're gonna head over to Advanced. Alright, guys. We got this new trap here. We're just gonna bait it with an apple and maybe some peanuts. Alright guys, we gotta bait it up a little bit. We got some apples laying around, some apples in the back, and then just a little trail going to the back. Um, we got some peanuts in the back too. Um, we just got it on in the woods. There's a few rabbit, and I know there's like squirrels that end up in these trees and stuff. So we'll see what happens. Probably tomorrow or morning, we might be able to get something. Yeah, but it should be good for rabbits and squirrels. Do you want to show them how it works? Yeah, so yeah. basically it just walks in and then there's just a little table in the back and stops on it, clamps mm. down. Done. So, yeah, that should be good. We'll let you guys know if we catch anything. So, it'll, po it'll probably be next video. So, right now we're going to go work on the mini, so stay tuned. These are all wet. All right, guys. Just set the squirrel trap. Going to advance auto parts, and then after that, we'll put this on and whatever we buy at advance auto parts. So stay we'll hit it at 25. All right, guys. Heading over to Daddy Auto. Um, my hit him with the. Oh my gosh. Oh! Oh! Yeah. oh, oh. <laughs> All right, guys. Whipping up to. Auto Daddy to get some parts for the Mini, so we're going to see what they have. Alright guys, Auto Daddy didn't have what we needed. We're going to go head up Tractor Supply and see, or, or um, Harbor Freight and see if they have any mini bike chains because it's clapped as hell. So, we'll catch up with you. 
Alright guys, we're putting up to tractor supply here. Probably gonna buy some, I don't know, might buy a chain for the Mini or some sprockets if they have any. Might just even buy a whole new Mini. Yeah, I might just buy a new Mini. You know, we'll see what, we'll see. And just trade in the Fiesta for a Mini. A couple Minis. Yeah, Probably. Whoa, 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 whoa. I don't know how big it is. It's 196 for 196? That's nice, boys. <laughs> Dude, this thing is comfy. I feel like I'm on like a low rider or something. <laughs> Alright, guys, right now, the goal is to move. The tank that's right here, it's like kind of a. It's like your thigh goes on it, and it's just not ideal. So we're going to put it back here now. Because we've got some more of that feline. So right now, I'm just going to. Here, hold this. We're gonna drain the gas out so we can put it in the new one. Oh. Hold on. Where's my. Go get my knife. Alright, that's it's almost gone. Huh? Alright, so now that the gas is gone, I'm gonna take it out from here. Alright, right, guys, we got the seat off and the gas tank off, and we're, we're thinking we're just gonna mount it back here and just screw straight into the frame here. And then it'll just be like that. So, yeah, we'll let you guys know once we have it on. Alright guys, as you can see, I just drilled these out and then I just screwed them in so she's not going anywhere so that's good. Um, we're going to get the seat back on. Alright, I'm just putting on the fuel on right now. We just got hooked up to the carburetor and then going to run it back under here and right there. Alrighty, so we got... They hooked up here to here. Should be good. I'm gonna put some fuel in it. Make sure there's no leaks or anything. It just I just got a nice down slope so the gravity will do its job. Um so yeah, we're gonna toss some fuel in it and see, make sure there's no leaks. Alright oh, guys, she's running. I think she's getting fuel. Alright boys, in the last video you saw it running, then it stopped or died. We um shortened up the fuel line a little bit so it's more straight down and it runs good now. Um We're gonna close off this video right here and then in the next video we'll be working on some more of the things. <coughs> Basically what needs to happen to this thing is <clears throat> new pulse pulse star or fix the one we have. Throttle, new brake pads, new chain. New sprockets. That's what needs to happen pretty much and that should be running good. Um, if you guys are wondering, I did change the oil on it like a month ago, so that's good. And then, yeah. So, thanks for watching and catch you later.